what's up you guys it's your girl d welcome or welcome back to my channel and today i'll be showing you guys this eye look and i'll be trying out the new Too faced born this way 24 hour matte foundation if you want to see definitely keep on watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and turn on post notifications to be notified the next time i post thank you So you guys, I've already done my eyebrows off camera and to conceal them, I used my LA Girl Pro Concealer in the shade Fawn. So we're just gonna go straight into the eye look. I don't know what look I'm going for yet, but I do know I'm gonna use pink, kind of inspired by my nails. So I got this um, AVH Norvina collection palette and this is what it looks like. Really cute, really cute. So I think I'm gonna use these three shades right here or these three shades i'm not really sure yet but we'll see where this takes us so first thing i'm gonna do is i'm going to set my concealer with some sasha buttercup setting powder And I'm gonna place that right here over my crease. I could tell these colors are very pigmented already. And I'm just gonna pat that on. Girl Pro Concealer in the shade Fawn and I'm going to just cut my crease. So I just put a little bit of concealer right here. So instead of cutting my whole crease, I'm just gonna put the concealer on the center. Y'all know what I'm talking about. I'm just gonna put the concealer in the middle and I am using this mirror right here. Back in with this shade again. 
I'm just gonna pack that even more. I'm gonna take this brush right here and I'm just gonna tap in that concealer. Using a packer brush, I'm going to take this shade right here. I'm just gonna pack that in the middle. of the eye i know this shit looks crazy but it's gonna get it's gonna get worse before it gets better i'm just going to blend this out Maybe when I do my whole face, like, I'll like it even more, but now I'm going to take my Cap On D Tattoo Liner and I'm going to do a wing. Alright, so I did my wing off camera and now I'm going to carve out the top of my eyebrows with my LA Girl Pro Concealer in the shade Chestnut. For the fun part, I'm gonna be trying the new Born This Way Matte 24 Hour Undetectable Super Long Wear Foundation, and I got this in the shade Chai. I really, really hope this is my shade because at Sephora, you're not allowed to test out the makeup anymore, you can only test it out on like a palette or something. So, yeah, I'm going to read you guys what this product claims to do. All right, so first it is a light proof foundation that controls oils and keeps you looking flawless for a full 24 hours. The coverage is medium. It is a matte finish. This true matte formula stays completely true to color while covering imperfections to reveal the all day shine free look of naturally flawless skin. The lightweight foundation is medium to full buildable coverage, non acnegenic, waterproof, oil free, and is transfer resistant. Okay, so that's that and I prime my face like I usually do with the milk hydro grip primer so what now we're just going to get into it I never tried any born this way products and I also got the super coverage multi-use sculpting concealer in the shade mocha so I hope that works out for me too
I think this is gonna be my shade. It looks pretty good so far. And I'm just gonna take my Lipix Techniques brush and I'm going to buff that in. And this has so much product in it, like, it was worth the money. take my beauty blender and I'm gonna start blending this out. Y'all, did y'all see that? Because I barely did anything. again and just cover up where I just concealed around my mouth because it's like a little bit too light for me in that area everything in with my Sasha Buttercup setting powder and I'm going to set under my eyes
definitely gonna have to contour my nose today because that was just super full coverage. I don't usually contour my nose, but today we're gonna do it. So now I'm gonna bronze by using my Morphe 3B palette and I'm just gonna take these two shades right here. slash highlighter in the shade in the shade savage and I'm also going to layer that with another highlighter in the shade St. Bart's I'm basically gonna do the same thing that I did on my lid to my waterline. Now I'm going to take an even smaller brush and I'm going to go in with this pink shade. And I'm going to put that right on the center. Urban Decay setting spray and I'm just going to spray this all over my face trying to get my eyes dramatic lash today and I'm going to be using these in my Slim by Ella lash palette. I'm going to use these. So for lips, I'm going to be lining with this NYX Suede Matte Lip Liner. And this is in the shade Vintage. take my NYX Butter Gloss in the shade Madeline. And lastly, I'm going to go in the shade Creme Brulee. And I'm just going to put this in the middle.
guys this is the finished look thank you guys so 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 much for watching and make sure you guys leave any products that you guys would like me to try down below and also make sure you, if you like this video you leave a like a comment and you subscribe thank you so so much and i'll see you in my next video